Hey guys, this is Pharaoh 2091 and welcome back to Let's Play Costume Quest. Last time we left off, we began this LP and uh, we had to save our sister Ren from the Grubbins, I believe, the evil weird monsters here. But besides that, let's go trick or treating because that's the whole purpose of the game, right? Trick or treat! <sighs> well, I guess you're the last of them. Better turn off my light. Yay, candy! Holy crap, it's a lot of candy. I, n I never got that much candy at any time I went trick-or-treating. Kind of sucks, actually. But, you know, hey. And even nowadays, it's like, not that many people go out trick-or-treating, at least in my neighborhood. Uh, for many years, it's been like that. I'm just like, oh, who the hell goes trick-or-treating anymore? I kind of feel bad, though. It's like the kids, you know, it's like they, you know, let them experience trick-or-treating. But, ah, uh, whatever, what can you do? I guess times, uh, it's different times, I guess. All right, well... Do you have some candy? Oh, look at your cute kids in uh, your adorable costumes. Man, a lot of people like you wear being policemen. I mean, the second one we already saw. Besides the real one, too. <coughs> oh, excuse me. My god, I... I that came out. Um, so you definitely want to look for any house that uh, has their lights on. That's, that's how you know that you can go there and trick-or-treat at the house. I'm not really sure how I want to handle this in terms of uh, which house to visit or like how to like tackle all these houses. I'm probably just gonna go like along a certain side and keep it at that. For the last time, no, I don't. Do not play the harmonica, because he's a hobo. Get it? <laughs> okay, no. Um, let's see here. More candy. I need. More, I need more candy. Sooner or later, we're gonna be coming across the uh, the kid who actually sells his battle stamp. So that eh, well, that probably helps us. I don't know if I actually bought it now. Oh no! Grr! You made me lose count of all the candy I'm stealing! So yeah, it all depends on whether or not, uh, when you go trick-or-treating at someone's house, you can either get candy or you get, uh, and just get candy for free, or you actually get into a fight. And, uh, sometimes it sucks, but what can we do? So, uh, I'll show off the new carrot and the new abilities as well. I'm not really sure how many fights I'm going to be showing off throughout the entire game, because a lot of it is going to be repetitive, so... Um, yeah, what can you do? So that's how you, you tackle the knight. Oh, crap! I How did I mess that one up? I already made a mistake. I never usually make mistakes in this game. It's so damn easy. Oh, in any case, let's just go ahead and get this going. Yeah, but I guess what I'm going to be doing for this LP is only showing off new, um, new enemies and new costumes. Besides that, uh, I'm probably going to be cutting out a lot of battles, which, trust me, is going to make things a lot quicker and make things a lot easier for everyone. So, well, there we go. Because these battles don't go by, they're not that short. Uh, now, he has, like, the shield ability, so he can select a party member you want to guard, and press A, and this gives them, like, in a, well, this gives them protection for, like, a round F, or I think one round. And uh, that's about it, I think. But it, it is helpful, but I really don't use it that much. And... Uh, boom! Oh, my God, he's not dead yet. I missed the. Uh, I already missed the uh, high levels I was at before. I can like defeat anybody in one shot, and we get new items. These are the creepy treats. Uh, there's really no point for them. Oh yeah, battle stamps from Sadie in the park. We'll get that from Sadie in a little bit. I forgot to talk about creepy. Creepy treats are just kind of like collectibles. Um, you can find here in the in the game. I mean, I, yeah, they're just collect. I don't think they really do anything for you. They're just funny collectibles like fruity foam and chunk water it's like oh you know but hey whatever uh i think for each page is are for a different area so the, this whole first page will be filled out with just the ones from the area we're in now the auburn pines like suburbs all right well let's continue on and uh but we need more candy because i like buying all the battle stamps even if i, I know i'm not going to use any of them or like there's some ones i'm not going to use i just like buying them all it makes things just a lot easier. Okay, and here's where uh, we came. Okay. Oh. Let's uh, see who's up here. Is it going to be a foe or a friend? It's a friend. Hurry up. I got to get back before the commercial ends. Who the hell are you supposed to be, a nerd? Ah, whatever. Thanks for the candy anyway, guy. You're all right. More candy for me. Ooh, more candy. Yeah. Yeah, sometimes candy will just not only be like, you know, you don't you don't only have to hit certain things to get candy. They're sometimes just laying on the ground. 
Uh, what is this kid doing anyway? What are you doing, kid? Yeah, I'm a ghost every year. Same amount of candy, less effort. It's actually not too bad. It's actually kind of a smart idea. Lazy, but smart. I applaud him because I'm not in some worlds or you know some areas out there. It's it's kind of like that. Anything new here? Oh, another air, another house. Trick or treat. Who's it gonna be? Oh no! Get lost. This candy is uh, in this house is mine. Take that, evil doer! You think you're gonna? Yeah, okay, we gotta get more battle stamps, whatever. So yeah, man, yeah, cutting out the battles is definitely gonna help us a lot. Trust me. I don't do candy trades. Well, you suck. I want candy. What? Damn it! So uh, yeah, like like I mentioned before, yeah, cutting out the battles will definitely help a lot. But I will show off the new ones. Don't worry about that. I mean, <clears throat> there's not that much of a variety, but um, I'll still show it off no matter what. Man. Why the hell not? Who's in here? Candy, 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 candy. Don't be greedy. One piece of candy each. That's it, only one? I don't know about your math, but uh, that's more than one. I think each house gives you 100 pieces of candy. I, I could be wrong. And I apologize if for some reason this game looks like it's stuttering or if it's slow, because I just noticed right now, sometimes it looks like it's only recording at 15 frames per second. Like right now, it dropped to 22. But I'm still playing... Just fine. I really hope this doesn't come out bad, or else I'm just gonna get really mad. That's gonna suck. Uh, we'll come back to this side, that side later. I'm just uh, I that's, that's kind of how I like exploring things. I just take it one side at a time. I don't know if you like if that's if it's if that's called something or not, but it's just kind of like how I like exploring. Um, anything else here? Ooh, there is a. Coffin or treasure coffin here, I can take a look at. But uh, first, trick or treat. Who's it gonna be? Oh, humans! Filthy, bad carrying humans! Damn it all. Is this gonna be a new one or not? We'll see. Is it? Come on. Hey, right, look, it's actually, uh, yes, these are new enemies here the Grubbin Shaman and the Grubbin Warlock. Basically, you can think of one as like a medic and a healer. I mean, like a like a mage user, magic user. Uh, let's, I like taking care of the warlock better because I I mean the shaman does heal him up, but if you want to take care of the warlock, it will stop like the like more devastating, hurtful magic. At least that's what I think anyway. But actually, crap! I forgot I'm not that powerful, so the shaman's actually gonna heal him up, isn't he? Yeah, damn it. I didn't really think about that, but you know, screw it. I'm. Oh man, he put me. He got me on fire. Yeah, that's another thing. Uh, some grubbins can do. They can actually, you know, set you on fire, and it's gonna hurt over time. It sucks, but what can we do? Oh crap! So we actually used uh, the shield. Now I don't know if uh, using missile barrage is gonna help or not. So that's why I'm only gonna hit him once like that. And I'll use guardian shield on Everett here because uh, the fire is going to keep doing damage to him, so I might as well try avoiding anything else on him. Like that, see? And, and shields only it only takes one damage, so that's why having the defense is amazing sometimes around. But using Mist Barrage, actually, yeah, it does set them on fire as well, so I kind of forgot about that. That helps. He might actually die right now. Ah, uh, well, I forgot, it's only eight. Oh, uh, and he healed up. I hate that, but what can we do? Have some of my rocket fist. There we go. And finally, say goodnight. Easy as that, guys. And we actually got a well, we got a new treat, the wobblers. Ooh. Yeah, there's gonna be there's gonna be a bunch of like treats that you're probably not gonna see because I might be cutting out a lot of these battles, so um But you're probably not missing much. I'll probably go over the treats once I get them all, but you know, hey, whatever. Yeah, I'm really wondering why the hell like the frames are not recording at what I want them to record at. I'm gonna have to check the settings after this. I really hope this look at this video looks okay because if not, then well, frankly, I'm gonna be pissed off because I don't feel like recording any of this again. Or I don't like re-recording. You know, when, when you're when you're on a roll, you just don't want to re-record. I hate it. But you know, sometimes yeah, you have technical difficulties when you make LPs and. 
really can't do anything about that. There is some candy here. Nah, that's how you get to that treasure coffin. What's in here? Candy! 50 of them, exactly. Man, that's a lot. Seriously, how many pieces of candy did you guys get when you were uh, growing up? I mean, I, I think maybe the most I got was like 20 or 30 pieces before, but... Or maybe my neighborhood is greedy, I don't know. Hello? I had that same costume when I was your age. You get a little extra for that. Why, thank you! A hundred... Man, a hundred pieces of candy for each person. That's amazing. But what can, what can you do? I mean... This game's not supposed to be realistic, I guess. I mean, yeah, of course, it can't be realistic because... When was the last time your costumes, uh... You know... Turn lifelike and defeat a monster's... I can't get through? Sorry, this storm drain is a hazard and off limits to anyone who doesn't know the password. Come on, let me in. Eh, whatever. It's not gonna let me in. Uh, hello? You found me! I'm playing hide and seek with my friends. Wanna play? If you find all six of us, you get a prize. Okay, and then each area you also get to, uh, you can play hide and seek, and I... I think if you find all the kids, you actually get a better, uh... You get a bigger pail, a uh, bigger can uh, candy bag. I think that's. I think so. Anyway, fairly certain. Anyway, I, I can't really remember all too well, but I'm, yeah, I think that's right. All right. It, it's it, it kind of like you know if you take in like the actual like decorations for the Halloween and whatnot. It's actually pretty cool. This game's awesome. Who's it gonna be? The suspense is killing me. Oh no! Urgh, you look you look just like my parents, from whom I'm barely <laughs> Oh my god. Alrighty, that was kind of funny actually. Sorry if you missed out what I said there. They, they kind of go a little fast for me to do voiceovers of, but uh that, that was just seriously funny. Uh you're wrong about parents, which I am uh what do you say, Astrowned? Well he he just doesn't talk to them anymore, and it's like what the hell? Uh good times, I guess. Uh, what's going on here? Careful, people are watching. Watching us do what? If you don't know, then you must not be, not, not be doing it. Huh? What does that even mean? Well, what's going on in here? Sorry, private party for patriotic heroes. That's us! Pfft, your costume celebrates science and a monarchy. How's that patriotic? Look, I have a colleague in front of the steps over there who might be able to inspire you. Just tell her I said it's a matter of manifest destiny! Got that? Uh, sure? I think he's talking about you. I have a manifest destiny! You should see a doctor about that. Here, let me give you this prescription. Oh, we got a costume pattern for the Statue of Liberty! Awesome! So yeah, they're not gonna let us in this a little area until we have something patriotic on. But don't worry, we'll get that sooner or later. What the hell? Yeah, okay, yeah, there's some stuff we need to get in there, so yeah, we gotta get the Statue of Liberty costume, and then we can get back here. But first, there's a lot of stuff we want to do here. Mainly just getting a lot of candy. And if I haven't mentioned already, um, I, I got all the achievements in this game, like the scene achievements, besides one. That, that one being, being you have to play Costume Quest on Christmas. Although I'm sure you can, you know, change your system date to Christmas and just do it like that, but... I really don't care for achievements as mu that much anyway, but um, and achievements were easy to get anyway, so that's why I got them all. Uh, but there is one to actually use the rocket ability or rocket skates ability at 15 different ramps, so you can easily get that around this town. This town. Uh, are you gonna let me through? It's about time you kids volunteered. The school big scales covering counting on you. Actually, Mrs. Putter, Putter Pam, we need to get past you so we can trick or treat at those houses at this big gate will... Nonsense! Trick or treating can wait! I need help making pies or else we'll have to cut the RPE classes! No more PE? Right on! How dare you speak to your principal so irreverently, or irreverently, whatever. I will see you Monday, Monday, Monday morning in my office! No, please! My mom will kill me if I have to go to your office again! Is there anything we can do to see that Everett doesn't get in trouble, ma'am? Yes, you can go fetch me an ingredient to help with the pie bake. Uh, with the pie bake, yeah. Hurry before I change my mind and give you both attention on Monday. Isn't that, like, illegal to do? She's like... We didn't do anything really wrong. Ah, whatever. And, well, this is actually, uh, the park. We're not gonna help all that old battle axe, are we? 
But we have to, yeah, so get past her. Uh, well, actually, let me just go ahead and get that there. Um, oh, I'm, I'm just getting this stuff around the park real quick. Okay, now let's go into the park. Uh, this, this kid here has a thing on top of his head. Oh, man, you collect creepy treat cards? I just need one glop to finish my set. Uh, trade you a rare one for one? I have my own set to think about, but I'll let you know if I find any dupes. Oh, man, sweet! So, yeah, if we find a duplicate gloop card, a glop card, then he'll give us, uh, a rare glop card, or, I mean, um, treat card. Creepy treat card. I don't know if it really means anything, if it's really... If it's... Yeah, it's not really no point to it, but you know, it's a quest you can do, so... Whatever. Oh, but there's some stuff we can do here. Kids, you're in grave danger! Finally, an adult who sees what's going on! Do I, uh, do I ever? Tonight, we are under attack! By Sugar! Is that your nickname for one of the monsters? Sugar is the biggest monster of them all. It, it rots your teeth, gives you pimples, and makes you fat! Wait a second. And that's why I'm out here tonight promoting healthy eating through the classic game of Bobbing for Apples. You want to play? No. Great, let's get started. Grab as many as you can before time's up. Green apples are rare and worth more points than red. Oh, and I only buy organic produce, so watch out for worms and other parasites. What? Go! Alright, so this is like a little mini game, Bobbing for Apples. You're going to find us in each, each area. So... Like you said, go for the green ones. I mean, if there's not, if there's not, if there's no green ones, then just go for the ones available to you, like the red ones. Don't get the half-eaten ones, and don't get the ones with the worms in it. So, and this isn't hard at all. I don't think I lost once uh, doing playing this game. It's it's a simple, just simple fun, really. That was amazing. You got you got more apples than a teacher on the first day of school. So what do we win? Candy. Awesome. Wait, is this a trick? Aren't you supposed to be promoting good ha dental hygiene? Of course! So here's a sweet reward to help you remember your lesson. It's called positive reinforcement. Duh! Okay. Thank you. Come again. How about we come right now? Hello. I'd like to learn more about good dental hygiene. Well, you came to the right place. Let's get bobbing. Now, I was thinking of cutting, cutting this out because, you know, it takes some time. I mean, you... Oh, crap. You can, you can play uh, three times to get different rewards. And then after that, um, I think you get, you just play for a high score. So basically, I'm just going to play this game two more times. And, uh, well, that, that's that. But, you know, I, I, like I said, I was thinking about cutting this out. Probably saved me like a minute or two of a video. But it, it it's it's not that long at all. So I might as well keep it in. Whoa, I think you just kept the doctor's way for a whole year. So what did we win this time? More candy! Oh, yeah, I love this guy. All right, you make no sense, but I like you. Can I play again? I like to learn more. Okay, so this is like the last round before we just get it playing for high scores. So we had to get 30. And of course, in later rounds, it's, um, like when we play the bobbing game in different areas, it's going to be like, oh, man, we got to get even more apples. But trust me, it's, it's just not hard. I mean, each greed one gives you three points. And they give you a good abundance of uh, green ones, so, you know, it's, like I said, it's not that hard at all. Even if you think you're running out of time, you're not going to run out of time. I mean, look at that. Boom. It's easy as that. Okay, give us our candy. I got something better than candy. Oh, here it comes, the catch. Bet it's a toothbrush. Now it's a sweet tooth creepy treat card. This is actually pretty cool. That's the best prize I got, and the last one. You play again, but from now on, it'll be rec I'll be recording your high score for posterity. Meh. Hey, sometimes personal sets are greatest reward of all. So, if you guys want to do that, then <coughs> go ahead. Uh, but actually, I'm just gonna... Oh, this video's almost finished anyway, and now I'm thinking about it. I mean, I only got, like, a little bit left to do. I mean, I, I'm close to 20 minutes, so... I'd like to end it off. Yar, you found me, booty. I, I, I guess I did. Uh, anything else? Oop, there was a little bit of, a uh, candy there. Ah, uh, move! Let's see, anything else? Nope. Oh, yeah, there was a little bit of candy. Okay, and, of course, the main aspect you want to come to the park for is because we have Sat uh, Sadie who gives us the battle stamps. Stop my timer real quick before that timer thing goes off. Okay, hello. Hi, could you please stop yelling? 
Yeah, we need to concentrate. We're fighting monsters. And those boring costumes? Our costumes are amazing! Yeah, FYI, we've been slaying monsters them all night. I'm just saying that you could use a little zing, a little zow, a little customization. Interested? Depends. Where are, you, where are you charging? Just a few pieces of candy. A small price to pay for battle stamps. What exactly do these battle stamps do? Glad you asked. Please consult my menu of tonight's specials. So here's all the candy or the battle stamps that uh, Sadie has for sale right now. So I'm just going to go ahead and buy what I can. So we got like increased attack power. We got uh, adding chance of dodging enemy uh, attacks. Increased HP. And uh, we, you also get different abilities. Now, to be honest, I am probably not going to show off the different abilities because honestly, I don't think I ever used an ability except like once or twice in this game. So I probably won't be showing off any of the abilities, but I'm going to go ahead and buy them for anyway for, you know, screw it. And damn it, I don't have enough money for the last one she has, which is counter attack upon a successful defend. Uh, we'll get it later. So, uh... Let's give increased attack to Reynold, and I'll give you increased HP. Why the hell not? And we'll come back once we find 250, uh, well, a little bit more more pieces of candy. But uh, for this episode, guys, I'm going to say it's uh, finished. And before I can end off like this, anytime you see like little areas like this with a floppy disk, that's pretty much a save point. Hello, police? Do you know monsters are invading the town and stealing the candy? Oh, also, they kidnapped my... Very funny, kid. Happy Halloween to you, too. I'm serious, this is an emergency! <sighs> okay, I'll add your complaint to the police log. Man, I hate working holidays. And that's how you get to save, so... That's that. In any case, guys, as usual, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time for Let's Play Costume Quest. I'll see, uh, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys later.